Chris Brown, his recent meet and greets, past two recent uh, episodes, we reacted to those ones. And yeah, it's getting a lot of heat, a lot of flack, a lot of pushback. But he's just offering his services for people. It's not his fault. He's getting thousand dollars. Give him the most once in a lifetime experience. And these photos are once in a lifetime photos with a celebrity. Yeah. Wow. I mean. Yeah. All right, I love that boy. Like so, and I can I can feel that energy. So when I get into an arena. You know, the, the, the fans are the really ones that keep me here. Bro, you changed the meet and greet. <laughs> oh, yeah, you got some black <laughs> behind that, too. Huh? Like, nigga, you literally changed the meet and greet. I, I, I'm going to I'm gonna say this, okay? All right? They got on his ass. I'm, like that. I'm, let him do like I'm three not bones. doing... <laughs> okay. <laughs> I might have to do something. <laughs> Yeah, you got you got to at least, at least. I might have to do something. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But the Chris Brown meet and greet is out of control. You might it's need dis- to bench press. It's or something disrespectful. There. That shit fun. Like I, I bet it. Is. <laughs> it's fun because look, you, where else in the time like everybody usually like you get your pictures back in the day. Uh, uh, the artists like, yeah, 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 you know, yeah, yeah. like same don't touch one, me. Same, yeah, yeah. Your, yeah. Like, and I don't do. I'm not doing like 150 people a night. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so it might it might be a small intimate group of people that actually spent that money that they might not even had yeah. to come and meet me. So I'm not gonna make they they moment. You know, I don't want to make they moment just some. Hey, what's up? Let me sign this. Get the fuck out. Like, that's weak to me because I feel like these are the same people. No matter how big of that group or smaller that group, I feel like they're the same people that's a part of the the family aspect. Yeah. yeah. So so and some of these girls is man, that's their bucket list. Some of them they like look. All I want to do is just be able to be on him. Cool. As long as you ain't got COVID, we good. So I should, I should tell <laughs> I should tell my wife she should loosen up and let me yeah and let me really greet them. yeah <laughs> yeah but you can't do no motherfucking pictures with your shirt off because then you can't you can't you can't gauge it can't what be the skin person skin. it can't be skin yeah because you, you don't you don't know yeah, what yeah, you yeah, yeah, yeah. might lick your stomach or something you gonna be like hold on yeah, that's- all right this is my opinion yes he's a celebrity but again you don't know his life he is a stranger and if a woman goes out and you let a stranger put hands on you and you made it so easy for that person to do it then what the fuck that's the boundaries that you set you wouldn't let any stranger any guy put your hands on you you seen those pictures like that's crazy the hands on the butt and stuff like yeah it's once in a lifetime but when you go back to real life You know, that picture's gonna live on. You don't want that. You don't want people to think like, oh wow, you put your, put, you let this guy, it doesn't matter if he's a celebrity or not. You put, you let this guy put your hands on your ass or carry you a certain way when your man, your future husband, person you're gonna see every day is gonna see that. it, it, it's it's people are gonna think it's insecurities but no that's boundaries man that should be only mine to put my hands on and not any other guy you know i think there was a recent one um a lady she was handicapped took a photo not so bad but chris brown gave the thousand dollars back and uh an extra ten thousand dollars which is cool yeah so experience of meet and greets, the lady got ten thousand dollars, and then th- that's pretty awesome. But these other ones is just like, whoa! You really let a stranger, or another man, put your hands on you like that? Yeah, I must have something to say about that. <laughs> There's no way you're gonna fucking get away with that. You know what I'm saying? It's not insecurities. It's my boundaries. Okay, people.